Dan Bush, a chiropractor from Venice, Florida who has already written over 500 medical exemptions for students whose parents don't want them to wear masks, has a huge turnout today at his event to sign hundreds more. Dan Bush has a huge turnout today at his super spreader event to infect and potentially hundreds of children. How does Dan Bush keep his license while holding events like this? How can a chiropractor be authorized to sign these exemptions? So he's issuing them based on his own medical opinion alone. He's making a pile of money. He's not doing it for free. There are lots of doctors who do it for the money. I'm sure there are lots who don't hold large public gatherings but they were doing the same thing. Does anyone know how much he is charging? Or is he doing this for free to gain customers? I would say patients but... Chiropractors don't hold medical degrees, so they aren't medical doctors. How do they get a medical exception when he doesn't have a medical degree? A chiropractor is not a medical doctor and a letter from one shouldn't be accepted for such a purpose. Can optometrists and podiatrists write letters, too?